really quick robbery. Yeah. We've seen something like this. Hey, hey. Yeah. Jared, take a look at this. Uh, yeah, they must have knocked the guard senseless. Rookie, could I have a look at that? Yeah, sure. Again. Wait, hold on, hold on. Chief, Chief. Let's see this. It's good intel. Hmm. This man. I think I've seen another crime like this. Really? Where? Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Um, do we have any evidence that was left behind? Um, Chief, I think I got something. What is this? It's, um, it's like a briefcase that that we found, and I'm not sure if it really has anything to do. It's locked. Yeah. Um, whoever is, who, whoever held this is smart. Yeah. Whoever's in here, we have to get out. So. Jared, yeah. is that the intel book? Mm. Let's see. Uh, why do you need it? I don't know. No, I think I might have found a breakthrough. Um, you found the criminal. Yeah. Um, could you move it to the J section? The J, okay. So, uh, is this by first name or last name? First name. Okay, do you want me to go early into the J section? Um... Yeah. Okay. Jacob D. Crestor. Oh my oh. Might be light brown. Known for eight murders. What? Two escapes from jail. And over five million dollars stolen. When did, when did he steal all the, that other money besides the three million? When was that? I don't know. But the thing that's insane is that this is over half. He just stole over half. He stole double of what he stole before. We gotta tell the chief. I got it. Oh, you got it. Chief, we have a major break in the case. Pull up a seat. Alright, Chief. Um, this book right here has intel on everyone who has ever lived in New York City. Alright. You boys want a cigarette? Um, sure, sure. yeah. Use one. They're camels. Be careful with them. Alright. Put it on the lighter. I'll save it for later. What's the name? Jacob. Jacob D. Crusher, yes. It's okay, we all make this name. Alright, I see him. Alright, so, Jacob D. Crusher, eight murders. Yes. This man's got a base. Okay. Yeah, he's like a Yeah. Five million dollars plus the three million that he just stole. So that rounds it up to like eight million? Yes. yes. Well, that sells it. Does this book tell us where he lives? Um, I think it's we're not allowed to include um, the addresses of who is in the book. I don't think legally. We're, yeah, legally, I don't think we're we can do that. Sorry, psychopath. All right, then that's all. That. What should we do now? Go after him. Okay. Yes, sir. We will find him. Sir. Yes. I think you're done for today. Hey, buddy. Uh, have you heard of that guy who's been robbing banks? I okay. certainly have. Are you an officer? A uh, private investigator, thank you. Do you have any leads on the case? Uh, I think we know the guy's name and his what past crimes. Here? There. We're gonna try and find him soon. Well, it looks like you have completed your task, officer. Too bad you couldn't tell the chief. Uh, yeah, uh, we- wait, what? 
I got him. You have him. Uh, he got into an altercation. All right. He hurt me really bad. You sure you can get him? Sounds like he got you good. Yeah. I gotta finish this. All right. Bye. Why? What did I do? You stole three million dollars. And you assaulted an officer. I thought you were a private investigator. Jared, the sword, no! Yes! Ah! What are we about to have a medieval sword fight or something? Well, yeah, that's, that's kind of why I grabbed the sword. <clears throat> Jared, I didn't even notice you. Yeah, hon. How are you doing? I'm good. So, uh, how does it feel to be the chief now? Big responsibility. Yeah, I bet it's... I have some really big shoes to fill. Hmm, yeah. Well, it's the one year, uh, mark since, you know, the museum yes. incident, yeah. Come with me, uh, Jared. Yeah. Why, what's going on? Um... Do you want to get a coffee? Oh, wait, the phone's ringing. Yeah, hello? Oh, what? Wait, what is it, Jared? I, I think this I think this is where the robber, come on, wait. 11th Street. Robbery, 11th Street. Okay, they, okay, they robbed the store on 11th Street. We gotta go. We gotta go quick. Alright. To the car, hurry, come on. Crimes of the Century. Will Mike survive this feat? We'll see you next week.